Hi everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids and this is my continued coverage of the HTC Desire HD mobile phone. Now one of the new services that HTC announced was the htcsense.com website and this works with either the Desire HD or the Desire Z. Now it's a service you sign up to, it's free of charge and this is the main screen you can see on your screens as I'm speaking and we've got some options here and we're going to go straight into dashboard. Now this first dashboard gives you a map overview here and also a location of your phone so you can actually track where your phone is. You can also forward calls to another number so I can forward to perhaps a mobile or a landline and I can even forward messages and here I can forward the messages to either another mobile phone or indeed to an email address so a great feature there now if I've misplaced the phone I can actually make it ring so I can tap the ring button and it will actually make the phone ring at full volume I can also lock the phone and erase the phone as well any missed calls that I've had whilst my phone's been switched off or in my pocket will appear in a list down here so I get a log of all the calls I've missed I can also go into the footprints tab and again this shows me the position of my phone and also allows me to follow where my friends phones are as well if they've allowed me access to that information and now I can go into my people hub and this is where all my contacts reside now I obviously can't show you all my contacts details for security reasons but here I can look at the various groups I've got set up I can even add contacts or groups on my computer and they will be reflected on the phone so if I've got a contact that's emailed me I can add it in here and it will add it into my contact list on the Desire HD fantastic feature next tab along is the messages now I haven't actually got any messages here but if I've been conducting an SMS message chat on my Desire HD and then I'll perhaps get back to the office I can complete that chat on the computer so it will appear here in sort of a uh, sort of a chat format with bubbles on the screen and I can type in and complete that message online this is great for if you're at work perhaps you don't want to be seen holding your mobile phone texting all the time well you can pull up this interface and complete your text online now the last tab along is HTC hub this is a really nice feature I've got a little drop down menu here and at the moment on, I'm on HTC likes which is their recommended apps if I click on an app it actually tells me about the app gives me a sort of screenshot I've already marked this one so it will send me some instructions on how to download it on my phone next time I use the, the handset if I go back to apps and plugins it actually lists all of the apps and I can actually scroll left to right to give me an idea of what they look like on my phone screen so this is great there's Angry Birds I've already got that installed on the HTC Desire HD and again if I find one that I like perhaps air control I can get details of it or mark it for later downloading so let's go back onto this drop down menu and go into music and here it lists music again I can mark or get extra details about them and then onto scenes now I've already shown you scenes in a previous video but here I can gain access to extra scenes I can see what they might look like on the handset and I can even send the scene to the phone really really nice way of doing things the same with wallpapers I can send extra wallpapers to the phone as well so perhaps we like the look of this one here so let's uh, get some details on this one let's just have a look yeah I do like the look of that one let's send it to my phone and that should send it to my phone number and let's go back into skins we've got the same for skins I can actually send these direct to the phone I've got the same for widgets and I've got the same for sound sets now some of the selections on here are quite limited but I'm sure they will expand them over time I've also got some ringtone options here again I can send these all to the phone from the HTC Sense website I've got alarm sounds and last but not least I've got notification sounds so I can actually do quite a lot on this um, htcsense.com service it is a bit flaky at the moment uh, the things that I've been doing during this video haven't always been sent to the phone but for a good start 
they've got a, a very nice user interface and once they sort out the functionality so it works correctly every single time then I'm sure it will be a winner I really do like the fact that I can go into this HTC hub this is probably my favorite part of the service and browse through apps and actually uh, sort of send them direct to the phone I like that a lot well thank you very much for watching this has been my look at the htcsense.com service that's available for the Desire HD and the Desire Z mobile phones. Please do come back soon to the Geek and Noise channel because I'll be doing a lot more coverage on the Desire HD and next up I'm going to take a look at gaming. This video review is sponsored by EasyDraw, making drawing fun on Mac OS X.